Many times during the week we get calls on models for UDC 3000s, 2000s, 2300s. There's always a series number like UDC 2300, but then there's a model number that specifically identifies that particular control. It's on both two places. One is the outside of the box, on the control itself, and also on the case. The frequent one they give us is the one on the case, along with the serial number. In this case, it is a DC-2300 or DC-230B-E0-20-10s with a bunch of zeros, bunch of zeros, bunch of zeros. All those numbers typically could mean something, so it's important to have all of those numbers. It doesn't matter what series it is, the numbers run sequentially just like that. As a secondary check, if you're in the field trying to replace one, it's always a good idea if you pull it out of the case to double check the model number on the inside and the outside match. Because frequently in the field, they'll replace one with another one, and sometimes they're not always the same. Or they may add options, or let's say they ordered it without a auxiliary output, they needed one with, so they bought a different one that they didn't change the case. So it's important to know that the one on the inside the case is probably gonna be more important than the one on the outside of the case. Because like I said, sometimes they change or may change them around so it's important to get the one off the control.